Hey guys, so today I wanted to share with you my nail polish collection. I have all different kinds that I'm going to be showing you guys from OPI to SE to China Glaze to whatever, you name it. So yeah, I just wanted to share with you um, maybe some of my favorites, some things that I like and don't like about certain ones, and just to give you guys a little bit of tips and just some great ideas of maybe some nail polish or nail polish colors that you might want to purchase down the road. So let's go ahead and get started. I'm just going to start off with the glare ones first real quick. You can use these best as a top coat over a base color. Um, it looks really nice. And this one is a very bright red glittery color. It is getting Miss Piggy with it. So this is definitely from the Muppet collection. And it's a very, very pretty um, glitter one. I really like this. Also, I have Gone Gonzo. And it's a bright blue glitter one. Very, very pretty. Again, another from the Muppet collection. And then we also have Serving Up Sparkle. This was one of, I think, Vanessa Williams' Um, colors, but it's a very silvery um, glitter one. And then this silvery one is Pirouette My Whistle. So I believe this is from the New York Ballet Collection. I'm not quite sure on that, but you can Google it or just search for Pirouette My Whistle and it'll tell you, but that's a pretty one too. And then Save Me. This one's really cool. Um, it has all kinds of different color, colors of the rainbow glitter pieces in it that are like straight. And then you have your um, round silver glitter pieces behind it. It's just really, really cool and interesting to wear. And then lastly of my glitters, I have Divine Swine, again from the Muppet Collection. This is a really pretty purplish glitter color with a little bit of silver sparkle to it. So those are my glitter ones. So we had <clears throat> a few of those. Now we'll start off, I'll bring up, um, this was a few of the minis from the Spider-Man collection. Came in a pack of four. Um, I bought the minis because for me that's, that's plenty, especially when I'm trying out a new collection. These don't have the names on it, but you can buy the Spider-Man collection mini pack of four and it'll give you these colors. This is a really cool metallic color. It's like a bronzy. And then you have this really great midnight blue. This is one of my favorite pinks. I actually wear this a lot. I wore it to a wedding recently. And then you have this great um, gold bronzy with a little touch of green metallic color that comes with it. So these are just super cute um, as well. So definitely try those out. Those are fun. Of my bright OPI colors um, that are like matte finishes, I have these three. This is like a really hot pink. It's called Kiss Me on My Tulips. And I think it was from the Holland Collection. This one is A Roll in the Hague. I think again from the Holland Collection. These were just some really bright summery colors. And Red Lights Ahead Wear. So these are really fun, great, um, bright matte colors for summer. Um, I really like these. I only have one shatter by OPI and it's in a red color. It's Red Shatter. All right, my two rubies, um, ruby colors. I have Manicurist of Seville, very, very pretty color, and also Waka Waka, one of the Muppet Collection colors. Very similar in color. This one has a little bit of shimmer to it, and this one's more of a matte. So that's what I would say would be the difference. All right, and then I love this color. I wanted to bring out a couple of my, my metallic colors. This is a really glittery bronze color. It's um, Rally Pretty Pink, and this is a really fun, really, really pretty color. One of Vanessa Williams' polishes. And then I also have Metallic for Life, and this is a really cool, hip, trendy, fun black and silver polish with a lot okay, of bling so now I'm going to bring out my polishes with a little shimmer to them. So let me pull them over here. As you can tell, I have a lot of OPI polishes. I was unable, un unfortunately, to put them all in the video so you could see them all together. So I'm just kind of having to bring them out little by little. But that's okay. Um, so all of this set of polishes right here, they all have a little bit of shimmer to them. 
Um, this one is a really pretty taupey brown color, and it is wooden shoe like to know, wooden like W-O-D-E-N, and it's got a little bit of shimmer to it, very, very pretty. This one also is a great neutral, Gouda Gouda Two Shoes, G-O-U-D-A, a little bit of um, sheen or shimmer to it as well. And then I also have Black Cherry Chutney. This is a really pretty color with shimmer, and it's like a plum, a dark plum with a little bit of ruby mixed in. All right, this next one is Animalistic, one from the Muppet Collection. Very, very bright orangey red with a little bit of shimmer. And then I also have Petal Faster Susie, and that's like a shimmery, um, pink color. Very, very pretty. This is another plum color with shimmer, and it is Grape Set Match. I think this is another one of uh, Vanessa Williams' colors, and it's just really, really fun and pretty. And then we also have Pepe's Purple Passion with a little bit of shimmer, and it's like a good ruby with a barely little bit of purple to it, but it's pretty. And then this is another great color, and it's I Don't Give a Rotterdam. And it's like a bluish gray with shimmer to it, so it's a really neat, fun color to wear. Now, if you like sheer colors, these are from the New York Ballet Collection. Um, they are very sheer, but um, just very light, pretty colors. Um, I'll go ahead and start off the ones that I purchased from that collection. This minty green one is really pretty, and it's called Mermaid's Tears. And these are matte colors. They don't have a whole lot of shimmer or glitter to them. They're very, very sheer. And then we have Care to Dance. This is a really great pale pink. And then I also have Don't Touch My Tutu. This is a very, very great light, light, very light, pretty white color, creamy color. And then this is more of um, a, a neutral or has a little bit more of a taupe colored look to it. It says, Did You Air About Van Gogh? and is very, very pretty as well. And then this has a little bit of a gray um, color, and it's my point exactly. So yeah, those are all of my OPI polishes. Okay, next I have these really great colors by Goldie. I'll go ahead and bring them forward. Anybody can wear these colors. They go with just about everything. These are matte colors. Um, I got them actually in a set, so they are not labeled, but it's like a goldish tan. Um, this is really pretty with a little bit of shimmer to it. It's like a neutral um, brownish red, a very matte bright red, a bright plum color that's um, an, a matte, and then a lighter, um, I guess more of a raspberry uh, matte color. So these are very, very pretty. I wore these a lot in the fall. Okay, next I have this little set. My sister actually gave me these recently, and I think they're super cute. I believe she got these at Ulta, and these aren't labeled. They're by Pixel, and it's like um, an orange sheer color. Then we also have a very neutral sheer, and then a very matte kind of turquoise blue. This one has a lot of glitter. It's a great top coat, a whitish glitter, and then we have this really great hot pink color by Pixel. Very, very pretty. It's a matte. Okay, as you guys know, I got this polish recently. It's one of those magnetic ones by Sally Hansen. Unfortunately, I haven't used it yet, but when I do, I'll have a review on it. This is a color I've been wearing a lot recently by Finger Paints. It's a great neutral, and it's called Blank Canvas Cream. Really, really pretty. Goes with anything. Okay, and then by Essie, I have a lot of pastels by them. Um, I'll give you guys a quick look. These are labeled, so let's see what we've got. Some are mini, some aren't. This is a really great blue. And it's Coat Azure, Azure, however you say that. This is First Dance in red. This was like out of a wedding collection, I believe. It's a bright red. And then we also have Borrowed in Blue, as you can tell, um, a wedding collection. Very cool, neat blue color. And then a great neutral, and it is Made to Honor. So those were the three that I have from that. And then my regular size, size ones, this is a really great pearly iridescent color. It's called Kisses and Bisses. This one is an awesome color. I wore this a lot in the fall. It's smoking hot. It's a very pretty plummy dark gray. This by Essie is Topless and Barefoot, an awesome neutral. Another neutral that we have by Essie is um, San Tropez. I really like that color too. 
And then we have a very light um, lavender, which is nice as nice. And then a pretty pink, which is French Affair. So those were my Etsy ones that I thought were super cute, and I do wear them a lot. I have two brights here. However, I don't recommend these. Um, this brand of polish. It's by Nina Ultra Pro. It just doesn't seem to go on thick and evenly. I have it in an orange and a bright red. I don't know the sheen or something about it. I just don't love as much as my others. So anyway, probably shouldn't even talk about that one. Um, China Glaze. This is just a fun, um, pretty neutral, and it's heaven. And then I just have a couple top coats and uh, manicure coats from Ulta. And then Sally Hansen. I have these colors, but I don't really wear them. It's a yellow and then a super bright blue. It's fairy teal, yellow, and then yellow kitty here. They're crazy colors. <laughs> and then by Color Club, this was a favorite of mine um, in the fall, too. Um, these are awesome colors. These aren't labeled. I got it in a set, but they're awesome neutrals, and you can, can see they're very matte colors. We've got pinks, plums, and some neutrals. And then I have my e.l.f. colors here for a French manicure, or eyes, lips, face. And this I have been wearing a lot this summer on my toes. It's by Sinful Colors, and it is Boogie Nights, and it's an awesome orange color. Really, really pretty peachy bright orange. Okay, so I hope that was helpful to you guys and gave you guys some great ideas. If you have any questions, as always, let me know, and I'll see you guys again next time. Bye!